Welcome to Munich and the first day of Balmer 2013, where there's blue skies and sunshine, not just for Germany, but actually for this construction equipment industry. The press conferences are getting ready. Join us after the break to find out what's going on today. Welcome back. Well, the developing world appears to be one of those areas that a lot of the companies here are focusing on. And this morning we had a press conference from three companies that are kind of working together to address those market needs. The three companies, leading Chinese manufacturer Lu Gong, engine maker Cummins and automotive systems specialist ZF, have created a partnership to pull their talents to produce wheeled loaders specifically targeted at the developing world. Lu Gong president Yang Guanon predicted that the company could deliver some 50,000 wheeled loader units fitted with the newly developed Tier 2 L9.3 engines and with ZF axles and transmissions, and that suited the ambitions of the Western partners. The new joint venture is a real challenge from an engineering point of view. This is the first activity we do together on the engineering side. So we are a, a team consisting from uh, German engineers, uh, uh, Shanghai ZF engineers and Liu Gong engineers, and uh, we jointly develop a tailor-made axle for reloaders for the Chinese market. Well, we've been participating with Lugong in a number of markets, primarily export uh, for a number of those years, uh, and we've done very well in the excavator market, helping them uh, grow their business in the excavator market. But in the wheel loader market, I think we've learned a lot about how that customer uses the engine, what they want out of the engine, and so together we figured out how to optimize our engine, which was already very high technology and good power for that market. Well, we're joined now by Jeff Ashcroft, the industry editor. Jeff, these three companies have been working together for some years in various different forms. What's different about now? Well, Lu Gong is chasing the world market. It wants to get way beyond China and its domestic situation. And I think with the power of ZF and Cummins, it's going to open a lot of doors for them. So is it Lu Gong that's really the big winner from this deal? No, I think all three of them are going to win. But ultimately, I think Cummins at the moment has the most to gain, particularly with the new L9.3 engine that it's developed for Lu Gong which is going to be used in the massive, massive numbers market for wheel loaders in China. Well, that's fantastic. We look forward to hearing more about that in three years' time when they reduce their, produce their results. And So, Jeff, Cummins have got a bit more to do today, haven't they, because they're launching a new engine in a moment. So right. There's two new engines coming this afternoon, so we better get over there, Alan. We're on our way. Let's go. So new engines, new equipment, new systems, even new relationships. It's really been a newsy day here at Balmer 2013's opening day. Now we'll be back again tomorrow with all the news from the show. Meanwhile, I'm off to find the nearest beer keller. Goodbye.